When I was 10, my dad took me with him on a business trip to China. He introduced me to his business partner. As I went to introduce myself, I put my hand out to shake his. Unfortunately, in China, it's not done like this. He looked at me, he smiled, and began to bow. This one? In Israel, it means uh, wait, and in my country, we don't use this gesture, and uh, i never seen it before. So last summer, I went to Egypt with my family, and I realized that when you talk to people, people really get up in your face and close to you when you speak. I was extremely embarrassed. In the beginning, I found it quite intimidating. And where I'm from, that would just be considered rude. The Beaming Project, it's a research project involving different partners from the European Union and Israel. And uh, the main goal of this Beaming project is to develop the next generation of telepresence. So in Beaming what we're doing is that we're taking technologies from virtual reality, augmented reality, robotics, but we're using it to make you um, attend a meeting or a conference or a trade show in a physical space on the other side of the world. So it's not in a virtual reality. We want to use the same technologies, but to allow you to be present, co-present with other people in a physical space. So if beaming is about being there, then in IDC we say better than being there. How can we, given that we construct reality, we capture, you know, using audio, video, and touch, we capture this reality, maybe we can change it a little bit and to make it better for you than actually traveling to the remote destination. So this is called intelligent transformations, transforming reality. One example of these intelligent transformations that we are now working on in, um, in IDC is the um, cultural translation. When we imagine like people from different countries getting together, they meet and they have a lot of misunderstandings, not only regarding the language, but like every culture also uses gestures in a different way, for example, the way you express yourself in a non-verbal way. One part of the Beaming project is to add intelligent transformations. So we are not only mapping what people really do in these different uh, locations, but we translate it in a way that might be more appropriate or easier to understand when we speak about non-verbal communication for um, people at the other location.